Hello and welcome to the Rugged Rock Hound. Today I'm here with a bunch of friends. Everybody remembers Doug, right, from the Blue Opal. Here's Tim. Yeah, here's Tim. So we are looking in an area. We're not gonna reveal it just yet, just in case, but we'll see. But we're looking here for what's called flowering tubonics. So let's see what we can find. It sounds like it's few and far between. So we're gonna start here in the wash and then we're gonna work our way up and see if we can find where it's coming from. Wish us luck. Here we are down in the wash looking for stuff. It looks like the stuff usually occurs on this kind of sandstone conglomerate matrix. So we're kind of focusing on those rocks. But there's a lot of interesting things in here. A lot of volcanic rocks like these ones. So we're definitely seeing some, some interesting stuff. There's some of that conglomerate. There's a nice piece of calcite. Got some good calcite crystals in it. There are a little bit of kind of metallic formations in it. Might be getting related. So this is just to give you a feel for what the rocks look like. So you've got a lot of these pinkish white volcanic rocks. You've got some nice conglomerates. You got some sandstone. And you can see it's, it is quite a mix making it difficult to spot this stuff. And this is the first time here and I've never found this stuff before, so. I think it's uh, brand new to all this. A little more than a difficult. Just like taking a look at any suspect rock. Just right here in the side, I found some nice Levan black agate. We're actually not far from the Levan location. So, uh, yep, keep eyes open for some Levan black agate. So right, right down here, I just found this. This is some of it, see the uh, botryoidal habit on it? And then look at the side of it. Hopefully that shows up well. The lighting is really bad right now, but you should be able to see some of the structure. I'll definitely clean it up better when I get home. But I, this is the first piece, my first piece of the uh, flowering tubonics down here in the stream bed. Oh, that's probably the best side to see it right there. Nice. So here's this one cut open. Interesting. Not too bad, it's got some lines in it. Okay, Tim just found that one. So Tim found this just up from where I found mine actually. So nice, nice banding here. It's like a travertine. So we'll see if this has any of the tube structure in it when we cut into it, but I just found a piece definitely thing. promising. You just found a piece. Did you find oh, a piece? Tiny bit. That be it? No. There's the lines on that one. And he just found this one, Ryan did. So that looks like, I, I would say yes. Those That little bit right there, just a <laughs> tiny bit of black right through there. It's very small, but I'd yeah. say it is it. Just yes. enough. It looks like it. Tim found his first piece of black agate. Look at that. It's got some nice botryoidal right there in that little pocket. Yeah, it's just a small piece, but it's definitely Van Black Agate. Found this piece that I thought maybe, and I broke it open, and yeah, it's a low grade, but something. Just found this piece. It's really hard to tell from the outside, but I can see the banding there. Yeah, this is something we're going to have to cut into to get better. But you can see it. You can kind of see it on the surface. So that makes them harder to spot. So you want more of this reddish color. That's probably going to get to your higher grades. Here's this one cut open. Yeah. Yeah, see, these lighter ones are harder to see the patterns in them. But they're still pretty. Some wind blowing right now. Just found this piece, very dark on the outside, but you got the layers in it. Yeah. That one's not as good as the one that you Not as good as the there. previous one, but it's something. I'll hold on to it. So Tim just found Look this. That Look at vine. that. Oh. Levan banded black and white agate on the surface of that rock. That is beautiful. That is a nice piece. Good find, Tim. So we've come up quite a ways. There's an old road right here that runs up to the old mine up here. We're trying to decide whether or not that's like a black agate or the banded tubonics. 
and the banded tube on it seems to have disappeared. I think that's coming out of one of the hills below us, and that indicator that Tim just found supports the idea that maybe this mine up here, this old mine, is black agate. So we made it to the old mine where we th were thinking, oh, it might be the black agate or the onyx. And what do we find? Gypsum. Satin spar. Gypsum all over the place. I'm thinking this might have been a gypsum mine. Now we're up in the mine. And look at those blades of gypsum, books of gypsum, pieces, crystals, selenite, all of that. Old gypsum mine. No black agate or tubonics here. Here at the top of the mine, we got a nice vantage point. We can just look out over the valley. Not nothing. Beautiful layers of rocks. So we just met up with the gang and Ryan found several pieces right here in the road that may have come out of this little zone here. The mine's back that way around the next two hills. So maybe it's coming out right here, but look, he just found that one. Look at that. We should probably spray it. Look at that piece he found, just right here in the road. So I, I think it's coming out of here somewhere. We definitely need to search here. Here's this one cut open. Yep, looks about like what we thought. We're in the zone now. Ryan found another piece and I just found one right here. You can see the bubbles on the top. That's definitely a piece of it. Now, oh, I see another one right there. <laughs> nice. So we are coming, getting close to... Yeah, we are close to the source. Very good. I'm glad you saw the ones right here. Look at that. We're definitely close to the source. I, I think it's coming out of right here. There's some of that kind of agate stuff. Oh yeah, a little bit of agate. Yeah, I'm seeing tons of little pieces too now. Here's this one cut open. This side fractured. But look at that. Really pretty stuff. Here's this one cut open. The other side broke because it was just a thin slice. But there you go. Pretty stuff. Just found another little piece. Just found a big one. And right next to it, another one. Spray that thing off. Oh, isn't that beautiful? Look at that. Although I don't mind if you grabbed it, that's fine. <laughs> Just, I want, I want the camera out yeah, to see it. Oh, looking good. Ooh, and then this, thing. look at this. Oh, this one's massive. Might need a hand pick to get this one. Oh, I got it out. Oh my gosh. This is amazing. Thank you, Ryan. <laughs> Ryan just found that. Look at this, though. Giant. Huge piece. Beautiful. This one and this one. This is the only big one I've managed to cut for this video, so I'll have to cut the other big ones later. This is that big one I found, and... Oh, look at that. Look at that. So much going on all across that. Here, let's take a look at the other side. Very nice. Really cool stuff. Found another one right there. I'll have to cut into that and see how much there is. Nice. Here's this one cut open. Cool. I like the pattern. I do wish there was more contrast, though. Still very nice. Ryan said he found some pieces down here. Let's take a look. Yeah, it's got a little bit going through it. Oh, that one looks like it'll be good. It's quite dirty. Oh, that's yeah, nice. that's a good one. Look at that one. That's a good find. Yeah. Cool. Very nice. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, look at that wow. one. Wow, that is pretty. Uh, I couldn't miss that. How did they miss that? Didn't they, they just really walk up don't. here? Oh, yeah. How did they miss that? That is beautiful. It looks like Oh, a you flower. didn't miss anything. <laughs> it looks like a flower. <laughs> oh, beautiful. Just found this one. Look at that. 
And look, it's right up against the cow side. Yeah. That's cool. Uh, but that's the pretty side right there. Use this beautiful looking one cut open. Yeah, it looks great on the outside. And looks great on the inside. So you can see these little flowering effects down at the bottom. I think I just found a big piece. Oh my gosh. Spray that off, Tim. Looks like it's just that tip. Wow. Oh, it's a layer Imagine of it. Cutting that. No, it's all the way. Oh. I think that's a whole piece. Jeez. That's going to be amazing. Hey, Doug, you want to cut this one for me? <laughs> if you carry it down and I get one fourth of it. <laughs> sure. As the finder right. of the sword. Okay, this could not have moved very far. Something this big. So we broke into it and we found some good stuff. We weren't sure because a lot of it isn't, but some of it is. So we got some going through there. Look at that. Oh, yeah, look at right that. there. And that's, that's all crumbly. Fractured. Yeah. Yeah, yeah the, the stuff that's crumbly, you're not going to salvage. But well, this, this looks fairly solid, so maybe take this piece back. And I'll take this piece. And I'll take this piece back. This one looked good from the outside. Cut it. One half of it shattered. So here's the other half. The good half. Nice, huh? Really pretty stuff. Come up here. Just found this piece. We just gathered this stuff. That looks pretty nice. Because it's, it's fun for me. Just found a giant slab of it. Look at all the bubbles on this side. Look at the pocket marks on this side. And you got a little bit of, I sprayed it off over here. Oh, let's pull it up then so we can see it. And you can see some of the layers in it. That's a chunk. It didn't move far. It's a thin little piece. Right next to it is a thin little piece. Another thin little piece. There's this larger one. Looks really nice from that side. Ooh, nice. That. Sorry about the wind. Guess it's a windy October day. Very nice. So right where Tim's foot is, we pulled this thing out. Look at that chunk. Nice. It's got the flowering on the bottom part of it. I'll probably take that one back. And look at this. Just a big boulder of it that Tim's right sitting on. And then little pieces here and there probably came off of that right there. Oh, that's nice. Look at that. Oh, that's a good one. Yeah, that's a good little piece. So here's this one cut open. Oh, very nice. That looks nice. The colors in there. Here's this chunk cut open. Interesting. Interesting. It's got a bunch of like Retiated stuff in the middle of it. <laughs> so Ryan's got a nice boulder here he's working on. Trying to get some pieces Trying to get some of, of the nicer pieces off of it. So there you can kind of see it. And this whole boulder is all... Yeah. It's all, all of it. Okay, there's apparently a really nice one down here. Oh, Ryan's going to get it. This one you're talking about? Yeah. It's big. Oh my gosh. Now that is a stunning looking piece. Bring that on up here. Let's spray that thing off. Oh boy. Tim, out of the shadow. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Look at that That's thing. That's pretty. Now that is a keeper. The whole thing? Yeah, <laughs> okay. absolutely. Here's this one cut open. Looks very nice from the outside. Oh, and looks very nice inside. Look at that. Very nice. Yeah, this stuff has really nice patterns to it. Here's this one cut open. This looked good from the outside, so... Oh yes! Yes, that's a good one. The inside of that one. Very nice. It's the other side. Sweet. Here's this one cut open. The other side fractured and fell apart. Uh, that looks very nice. Very nice. Oh, Tim, what did you find? 
Tim apparently found something stunning. Oh gosh. And it's already Jeez. slab worthy too, so. Yeah, that's exactly how you would slab that thing. Ah, that's a nice find. And there's a boulder right there. Yeah. Boulders everywhere. Hard thing though is finding the really nice ones like that. Here's this one cut open. Very nice. You can see where it forms those little tubes. They're technically st stalactites that got completely covered with stuff. Okay, here is this one cut open. Very nice. Look at the contrast colors are great on that it's a beautiful flower that's a really good piece and we made it back to the vehicle so neat place I'm really glad Ryan found this spot and due to his wishes we're not gonna you know share the GPS here and the layer we found you know we worked our way up the hill finding little pieces it was a layer that was I don't know about a foot or two thick that had that nice uh tubular onyx going through it pretty cool spot um actually found quite a few things i didn't actually film because after a while you start finding a lot when you've got a layer there that just kind of runs all across that that one hill there it was pretty steep though you know <laughs> all that loose tailing but pretty cool so you guys have probably seen everything cut open and you'll see the ones that i probably didn't quite film because i kept switching between getting better and better ones but hopefully you saw most of the good ones and now you've seen it all cut so it should be amazing that stuff is beautiful i can only imagine how good it is when it's cut i know yeah tim's I can't excited wait. <laughs> until next time remember there's treasure everywhere